Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Kalpana, a Ravi Varma anthology, a musical journey inspired by the timeless art of Raja Ravi Varma. I am Sri Priyanka, your host for tonight. Prepare to be transported into the world of Indian classical music and the vivid imagery of Ravi Varma's paintings, presented to you by our very own NUS Indian Instrumental Ensemble. Kalpana is this year's installment of NUS IIE's annual internal showcase. The main idea behind our internal showcase is to provide an avenue for our musicians to work together in small groups and unleash their creativity when experimenting and coming up with their own musical arrangement, ultimately forming the performances that they will be putting up today. This year's theme is a tribute to a renowned Indian visual artist, Raja Ravi Varma. This year, we wanted to take on a challenge to show the interlace of two major art forms, music and visual art and see how even through music, we can interpret various art forms. Each group will be presenting their very own musical interpretation of a Ravi Varma painting, exploring a variety of emotions, ideas, and themes in the process. So enough of me talking, and let's kickstart Kalpana with our very first group. of India were nomadic people who regularly faced various hardships and difficulties like poverty, hunger and actively being persecuted and oppressed by society. Set in the Raga Dharmavati, this group aims to tell the tale of the Romani by evoking a solemn, heavy and melancholic mood. This piece will be an exchange between the various string instruments attempting to mimic the musical style of the Romani whose music was primarily strings-oriented. With us, we have Uma Gauri on the veena, Singtong on the guzheng, Neha Lakshmanan on the violin, Kao Tui on the tan bao, and Lakshmanan on the tabla. For those who do not know, For those who do not know, the guzheng hails from Chinese music, while the tan bao is a string instrument from Vietnam. So sit back as we take you through on the journey of the Romani.